I'm going to teach you a, a trick that I learned from a magician once. Um, it, what it was is the magician had a deck of cards, and uh, as you can imagine, he had me pick a card. But we're going to come back to that in a second because the cards don't matter as much as the box. What mattered about the box is he was able to have me pick a card, shuffle them up, he shuffled them up, and they put them in the box and he could tell me my card. But I found out later how he did it. What I wasn't watching, he drew a little door on the box like this. And this little door, oh, let's give it a little handle too. Let me let that dry. Was how he did the whole trick. So what happened, of course, as I mentioned, he had me pick a card. I selected it, shuffled the cards, he shuffled it, and somehow he shuffled my card, the two of clubs, to be on the very bottom of the deck. So what happened is, when he went to put the cards in the deck, he, as you can see, there it is, the top card, you were able to take that and come in a little closer for this. You could actually take that little door handle, open it up, and peek at the card. See, just like that. Did you catch that here? Try again. He could peek at the card real quick, and as soon as he did that, all he did is pull the cards out of the box, and if anyone had figured the trick out, they might have noticed the little door. But see, this is the only part I can't tell you how it happens, is uh, then he would take that little door, just kind of make it go away, and of course the deck would be solid again. You want to take a little look at that? Nice and solid. Uh, I'm going to grab this one, and uh, what I want you to do, uh, here we can get rid of those, put them in my pocket. Um, I want you to try to see if you can uh, do a little what I call bending of reality here. So I want you to take your your uh, bolt, what do you have? Is that a bolt or screw? So everyone can see it. Make face the camera if you could. And just see if you can make it bend at all. Can you make it bend? Nope. No, not really? Nope, all right. Okay. I'll tell you what, I've got a little screw in here. Why don't you take it and rub this one right here for a second. All right, keep rubbing it. Keep rubbing it. Whoop. Keep rubbing it. Look at that. The bending of reality. That's kind of how it is. Keep rubbing. We're going to kind of put it back in place here. All right, wow. Take a look at that. This, look at that screw. I just want you to point to any card and just push it out a little bit, out of the deck. So just find the one you think really might be that card. Anywhere you want. All right, there you go. We're just gonna push that out, make sure I'm not doing anything fancy, right? I'm just gonna take it right out of there. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna show it to the camera, all right? And I'm just gonna put it where, wherever you want. Where do you want me to put it back? Mm, over uh, you tell me. right there somewhere. Tell me when, where. Oh, that's good, that's right good, there? yeah. Okay, yeah. I'm just gonna throw it right back in there, all right? And what I'm gonna do is just shuffle this up a couple times. Um, oops. All right, and what we're gonna try to do is have you think of a number here. We're gonna show you how much of an affinity you have, whether you know it or not, for a card. All right, so I want you to think of um, any number from between one and 52, essentially. Okay, so it doesn't have to have anything to do with the number of the card that I just looked at. No, 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 no. Just think of a number. Just a okay. number between one and 52, all right? Okay. And I want you to now tell me that number. Seven. Seven, just seven. Just seven. Out of all the choices, you want seven. It's fine. If you want, or you can change it. Seventeen, Saint 17? Patrick's Day. Aha! Uh -huh. So you moved uh -huh. to seventeen. All right. You sure? Yes, I'm you sure. You change it again? Oh no, that's that's locked. In. Seventeen. All right. Watch this. We're gonna count down: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, mm -hmm. eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Right there, number seventeen. Right? Yep. Okay. Just want mm -hmm. to verify what we're doing. All right. So you had a choice of any card you wanted. Mm -hmm. I shuffled them up a little bit. You gave me a number. In fact, you changed your number. I messed with you a little there. You did. You messed with me a little bit. What do you think the odds are that that card is just showing you the affinity you've had for that card? There's no way. Let's take a look. Let's see. How'd I do? There we go.